everyone, I'm Sarah. And I'm Aska. And you're watching We're Not the Same. So, a while ago, um, I recently got out of another relationship that I was in when we originally started this channel. Mm -hmm. We tried filming this video a while ago, but it stopped filming halfway through, so we decided to do it now. I mean, it's better now than ever, right? We've gotten a lot of requests to do this, so here it is. This, this is, is how to get over your ex-boyfriend or girlfriend. This kind of works either way. I don't really know how it works for guys. I don't really know like what guys do, but this is what we do personally. So, so you can you can take this advice if you want to. I mean, there's nothing wrong with anything that we do. I think we're fairly normal human beings. All right, let's go. So number one is to binge watch your favorite show. Watch every single episode. Literally. YouTube channel, huh? Hint, hint, huh? Wink, nudge, whatever that was. Oh, thunk. <laughs> Smash. <laughs> so number two, eat a lot of comfort food. A lot. Who cares if you get fat? You're not here to impress anyone anymore. <laughs> you don't have anyone to impress. It's your life. You do what you want. <laughs> I don't even eat things. They're mine. My comfort food. The next one is to yourself and only to yourself say bad things about the person. To yourself. Just let everything out. It's really cleansing. Chances are you have unresolved feelings about the person and you have a bunch of things you want to say but you don't really want to say them to other people because you don't maybe want that person to know. It just leads to drama and that's the last thing you want. Especially when you're already heartbroken. Number four, keep yourself busy. You always want to be doing something so you don't have to think about the person. Mm -hmm. Like knitting or origami. I love how those are like the first things that came to our mind. Oh, number five, this is very, very important. Don't go around kissing other people to make them jealous. It doesn't work. That's not how things go. You're just gonna make them angry. And I think the last thing you want is for people to be angry. Like. Like we said before, we don't want drama. Hashtag anti-drama. <laughs> this one is a little bit contradictory, but I believe that it works. Just act like you're okay. Because you don't want to give them the benefit of knowing that they hurt you. Basically, the best revenge is not letting them get a reaction out of you. Number seven, whatever they gave you when you were in the relationship, give it away. It's just going to remind you of them constantly, and that's something you don't want on your conscience. 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 Good one, Sarah. She's a hypocrite. I'm very hypocritical. Okay. <laughs> because I still have stuff that my ex gave me, but it's hiding upstairs in my room, and I really don't know what to do with it, because I don't know if I should burn it or not. Tell me down below what you think I should do with it. Like, I can play baseball with it or something. Okay, let's do it. It's a jewel Next box. video is going to be Sarah destroying the thing that her ex gave her. Oh. This, this one, is good for Aska. This is exactly what I do all the time. Even when I'm not heartbroken, if I'm just sad or something, fangirl over celebrities. Or fanboy, whatever you are. Or YouTubers. Because YouTubers are our celebrities. They're basically our celebrities. We can give you a few examples. Adam and Nick. Connor Franta. Joey Kidney. Troy Sivan. Matt Watts. Tyler Oakley. Dan is on fire. Amazing Phil. Jack Howard. Dean Dobbs. Jack Harris. Finn Harris. <laughs> So the next one is to dress up for yourself. I think we both look really, really nice today. And I feel pretty. Don't even worry. You have no one to impress now. It's not their life. It's yours. So make the best of it and put dress on yourself how you want to be dressed. Just dress in things that make you happy. And the last one, the most important one, be with your friends. We love each other. And we love yeah, you. Let's go give them a hug. Let's go give. You guys are our friends too. We love you. <laughs> oh shoot. So yeah, guys. I guess that's the breakup video. Just before we go, I want to let you guys know that you're all amazing, and no one should be able to dictate what you say or do because it's your life. And however you want to live your life. You go ahead and live it. 
because no one else has a say except for you. So don't give a person satisfaction making you miserable when you don't want to be. And also, just remember that life goes on. Things happen and it sucks, but it keeps going and you have to keep going too. And whatever happens, we're going to be there for you. We're here for you. And your friends are there for you. Because sometimes that's what you need. A good friend. <laughs> From my living room with love. I'm Aska. And I'm Sarah. And you're watching. We're not the same. Bye! Oh my gosh, that video took so long just because we kept going back and forth, back and forth.